Hello children welcome to DP Kids once more i hope you're having a good time during this december so now snowflakes are something that our children like to make because although we don't have snow these countries where there is snow they have a lot of snowflakes coming down from the skies so even if we don't have it it's fine we'll make one from origami okay it's actually what we need today is kirigami not origami per se so let's start making the snowflake now fold it in half like this so it's first we are going to use origami at the beginning right then fold it in half again now mark the middle and then this edge maybe like one third of this edge so to meet that this corner goes up and uh, folds in right but make sure it folds properly like this from the middle but don't press down on it too hard so do the same thing on the other side now look without pressing hard on it if you look at it this is what you will get all the pieces will look similar to each other right parallel they are parallel to each other now we are going to press it down because it's all perfectly situated now we have to fold it in half so that we can have two perfect halves as well now we are going to use the scissor to cut so there's a line here so we are not going to cut any piece any uh, we are not going to put any cut beyond that So we can cut it out and remove it. Make sure it all looks neat and nice and tidy once you are finished with it. Now we have to draw some lines on it, some patterns on it. This side that is not opening, I have kept on my left hand side and using my right hand I'm going to draw like this. A line like this. Then this top part we can draw different patterns on this top part. But it should be there should be a little space like this here. Okay, when you're drawing the pattern. So we are going to cut along the lines that will not touch these spaces. So we can have a little uh, hole here so that you can draw a little line there, a little curved line. So different patterns. We can draw another half circle here, right? Now we have to cut it out. So since we are cutting it, it's called kirigami. Now if you are folding, it's called origami. If you are cutting, it's called kirimas or kirigami. Now carefully cut along these lines but don't go and cut across that other line in the corner. Carefully cut them out.
now make sure the other side is also being cut this is quite dainty work so be careful We can create different patterns. It depends on what you're drawing. You have to be very careful, otherwise we'll cut our hands or we'll cut the piece of paper in such a way that the snowflake doesn't come out right. Now we have to slowly open it up. Be careful. Now look at our snowflake. Kirigami is exactly like origami except that uh, we do it in a different way. But the mechanics of it is the same because we start with a piece of paper and get a beautiful product or beautiful craft at the end. So now since there's a hole here, can you see there is a Yama Orizen here and a Tani or is in here so you can fold back on these so to make it look more 3d or nicer if you use a thicker piece of paper it will look nicer although it's difficult to cut so then if you use a thicker piece of paper you can hang this up somewhere It'll look like real snow falling if my little children try these with your parents. You have to be careful of course with the scissors. So using origami and kirigami, make these snowflakes at home. Comment, like, subscribe to our channel. Okay, I will see you soon then. Stay safe children. Goodbye.